We're smashing the crate, so don't be late. Right after this. Hey guys, welcome to Smash the Crate, the monthly series where myself, along with my husband and my mother, try every item in this month's Keto Crate. Don't forget, you can get a discount on your very first Keto Crate by clicking the link in the description box below, or you can stick around to the end of this video to see if you won what's in this month's Crate Lego. Okay, so the first item, here we well here, we're not trying one of them. Uh, and it's the Skinny's cocktail oh, mixers, yes, I remember right? These. Yeah, this was uh, this is Baja Margarita, Yay. and you just yeah. add it to tequila and club soda. Like we have neither te tequila nor club soda, well, and so no. And so I was just like, you know what? We can't try that today. But I'm sure for all you drinkies out there that like drinks, this will be great for you. But we're not gonna try it. Next, we're trying Jimmy Pudding. If you remember when I did the Keto Crate unboxing, mm -hmm. like the, the Jimmy Pudding was just very congealed. Like it was like a slime that kind of just like sloshed around this container. Okay. I don't know if it's because it's like sat for particularly long or if this particular batch was over oiled, which mm -hmm. would made it so oily. But you can see, I put it in the refrigerator and like you can see the deposits of oil that have started to collect. Mm -hmm. Like not attractive in terms of like appetizing to eat, but let's see if it affects the, the taste and texture. So. Get a good stir first. Do you want me to mix it in? I would rather just work around oh, okay. it. But do you want me to mix it in? Uh, we'll ask third opinion on that. Oh. <laughs> I pass. Next question, yeah. please. <laughs> I pass. Next yeah, okay. question, please. Okay, well then we're just we'll going to eat around it. it. We'll just eat around it. Yeah, so... See, I mm -hmm. thought it was like, you know, natural peanut butter when it separates. Yeah, kind of that thing. Makes sense. And sometimes you just got to stir the ingredients back together. Okay, yes. do we want to do that? Well, I'm, I'm, not doing it. Yeah, just I'm, not, voted, I'm so not doing it. We're not doing I, it this I, time. I didn't vote. Okay. Yeah, so exactly. Anyway, Your yeah. absence of voting is, is not... Vo yeah, yeah, but that means you don't get to decide. This right. is a, this is an important yeah, le lesson yeah, in yeah, civics, yeah, people. Yeah. If you don't vote, then you don't get to have a say in what exactly. happens, right? But I will say what happens if I like this one. No. Oh okay. My um, okay, let's go. Mm, very gritty. Mm -hmm. This flavor's still wonderful, though. There is a grit in there that I don't quite understand. It might be because not mixture. Go ahead and mix it up, Christina. No, I'm just saying, could be. Watch it, woman. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get some of this on the line. See? Mm -hmm. mm, that's some of that. Okay, let's see what that does to it. I'll try some of the non gritty. Okay, so. That's delicious. That's a tier three for me. Like, what? Jimmy Pudding is a like the regular fudge Jimmy Pudding. Taste wise, it's a tier one, but ingredients wise, there are forty three total carbs in this. Yes, and so ingredients wise, I just can't mess with it. And while we're here, let's talk about our tiering system. That's why it's delicious. Tier number one. I love this. This tastes delicious. I would or have purchased this with my own money. It tastes so good. Mm -hmm. Tier two. You know what? I really like this. This is good. I wouldn't necessarily buy it with my own money, but if I received it for free, I would really enjoy it. That's exactly how I feel about the just the fudge. You know, I wouldn't buy it, but if I if I came across it, I'd be happy to see it. Is that it. what that is? The fudge? No, this is fudge peanut butter. That was peanut butter in there? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, and then tier three, which I think is like, eh, I mean, definitely wouldn't buy it. Don't hate it, but like, is this the first thing I'm reaching for when I want a snack, right? Like, this might expire because it's like I'm trying to weed around and find things that I like better, but I'm definitely just definitely keeping it. Yeah, and then tier four is this is nasty. I don't like the taste of it. And I wouldn't take it even if mm -hmm. offered for free because I don't like it, right? There you go. So for me, this is a tier three. It's just like, you know what? I would accept this. Um, I would just know that given the option between this and the regular fudge, I would take the regular fudge. It's a tier one for me on taste. And I guess three on the ingredients. The ingredients, so, yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. Is it a two? I guess it's a two on taste. One on taste. I mean, yes. it's, it's delicious. It to me, it's amazing. a three all the way around. Yeah, it, so it's just like, you know. Ingredients it tastes But thank you, Jimmy Pudding. But it tastes so I love me if you want minus some three. Jimmy Pudding. Mm -hmm. Okay, next. Oh, look where we're going. Ooh. Catalina Crunch in the little baby oh, packet. Wow. Where do we see these baby packets? At the 
Myrie. Either we saw it at Meyer because I oh, was really? thinking, yes, I was like, oh or my gosh, Catalina Crunch's little baby packets. It might have been. Was it at H-E-B? Was it at Walmart? I don't know. I feel like it was some grocery store. It might have been because remember we went to H-E-B yes. in Texas. In Texas. Okay. So this is fruity. Okay. This is Catalina Crunch fruity okay. flavors. Okay. Okay. Do you want a, you want a purple one? Because okay, okay, you get a purple one. Okay. I got a little bit of everything. Okay. Let's go. Me. Oh, okay. Oh my God. Fruity Pebble. Mm -hmm. Immediately. The smell. They don't smell Fruity Pebble immediately. Uh. Now the taste, I'm not there yet. But the smell, well, immediately. I might not have should have eaten this after the Jimmy put it. That's true. And everything has chocolatey to it. You can take a drink. No, this is mm. Fruity Pebble. The only difference is, since Fruity Pebbles are made with some sort of grain, you know, they disintegrate in your mm -hmm. mouth, right? So it's like Fruity Pebbles get soggy. I think more Fruit Loops. That's good. Fruity Pebbles. Maybe Fruit Loops. I haven't had cereal in so long, you guys. I don't remember. But, but Fruity Pebbles are the bigger, thicker ones. That, like a Fruit Loops are the bigger, thicker ones. Yeah. The pebbles are the small. Rega I know what they look like, Richard. I just don't know how they taste. Um, But regardless, Tons of fruity flavor. Yes. You do have to chew for slightly longer than you would that. on a loop or a pebble. I don't mind that Because at all. it doesn't disintegrate as easily as like a, a wheat-based cereal would do. Especially the way they've been designed now. Yeah. Pretty sure the first wheat-based cereals was pretty chewy. Exactly. Um, that's a tier one in flavor. Oh, like, that was good. Like I, I said. Oh, yeah. When the, I was the ingredients. When I was talking about this, uh, the ingredients are another uh, story. So the first ingredient, pea protein, and then potato fiber, mm. and then corn fiber, mm. and then chicory root fiber. Like mm. I was just like, they gotta eh. fudge those lines. And yeah, that. you know. So I also said this is one that really messed with my stomach. Like I ate like a whole bag of the other oh, flavor because yeah. it was delicious. Then I was like, oh my god, my poor stomach thinks there's a brick in there or something. You know. So it's just like. These are things, that's another reason oh, why I love the fact that they come in little individual pouches because then it's just like, away. exactly. Unless you know, you can't, unless you just headbutt the whole package. Yeah, of individual exactly. Yeah, exactly. If you just keep opening them, yeah, but still, <laughs> flavor wise, that's a tier one. I love that. That was really good. Yeah, I do too. Okay. Is that one of those flavors on those one taste, three ingredients? So yes. Like, yeah. It forms know, a right? two. It forms a two. One and three together make a two. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, next, crazy go nuts, buffalo walnuts. My mom's gonna love uh, this. Okay. I love walnuts. I talked about how I, I love, love buffalo. Yeah, I talked about how I love buffalo. <laughs> I talked about how I love buffalo flavored things and I love walnuts. Do I love buffalo flavored walnuts? Oh, we'll see. So, there you go. Just one I for you. Like, yeah, I think the walnuts are pretty yeah. big. Okay. okay. That'll be decent. Okay, so this, these, okay, like on the. On the package, they look red, right? Mm -hmm. yes. But these are definitely more of like a burnt brown, mm -hmm. you know, like they've dried or something like that. So oh, dry brown. Okay, let's give them a taste. Yeah. It definitely taste the walnut. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> you can taste the walnut. Yeah. Yes. And, and you, I'm okay think, with that. I think that's about like it. Spice. And you can taste. Well, this is the heat. I can taste kind of some subtle heat, maybe. Yeah, I'm working hard to distribute the chew around my mouth. I appreciate that. Okay. Thank you for because the heat. Because you can this. feel the heat. I don't know if this tastes like buffalo or anything. Mm, I just feel the heat. You can taste the I'm walnut. I'm so glad it wasn't overpowering me. I don't <laughs> like it, and I actually am not going to die. Yes. I ate one of those. But Did you feel any heat? I don't. I mean, not really. Okay, no. It was a very subtle heat. Yeah, it's very subtle. Yeah. Yes. It's subtle enough, but she didn't even know. It's it. like, I like the flavor of the buffalo. I can definitely taste the flavor of the walnut. Mm -hmm. I yes. don't like them together. Like together, I'm just like, mm, I feel like I'm having two separate experiences right now. I feel like just I'm eating spicy walnuts. Yeah, but, but like, it'd be different if it was just like a spicy, neutrally flavored thing to where all I tasted mm -hmm. was spice. But then you get the flavor of yeah. the walnut and I'm just like, ooh, I don't no, know I'm if those mix walnut, together. I get mm. that just like that. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's a tier three for me. Yeah. Mm, wow. Yeah. I have I'm to mad. say, it's a three for me. I have to say, uh, see, I can't say. Okay, what I say? Oh, say okay, what so you want. Two thousand years later. It's between two and three. So two and a half. Okay. Two point five. Okay, so yeah, mm, interesting. I mean, Crazy Go Nuts has tons of other flavors that I really like. It's just, um, because you remember the garlic parmesan? Oh, yes. Yeah, mm. good. Yeah. But the buffalo, eh, just wasn't my favorite. Okay, next, continuing on our buffalo kick. 
Shrewd Food Protein Puffs Buffalo Ranch. I think I've, I've, ranch. we've tasted Shrewd so, Food. Yeah, we've definitely tasted Shrewd Foods. I don't think we've ever tasted Buffalo oh, Ranch yeah, before. Yeah. I remember what the puff looked like, a big area. Yeah, I buy oh, those wow. quite frequently. Oh, what, what flavor? No, just a, with a sour cream. Oh, so you have sour cream and onions. Yeah, yeah, I get those like And what are these time. again? Buffalo, Buffalo Ranch nice. Protein Come Puffs. Ranch. These are Come very ranch. cheese puff. Like, these are yeah, huge. No. And they do have a nice orange Give color to them. Cheetos so. vibe. Let's go. Mm. Wow. Mm. Wow. I do taste the buffalo and the ranch. Yep. Do you want Whoa! Is that celery? What? It's a thumb down. Missy Poo. Oh, golly. Woo! We got him a little bit. Oh, wow. Then we mm -hmm. lost. Then we lost. Uh, I know. We lost Christina. Oh, my God. I hate you. Mmm. Oh! Oh, that's good. Whoa, tier one. Oh, I mean, it's spicy. I can yeah. hear you. Have that one, please. No. Oh, yeah. mm. oh Lord. Oh, my God. Where's the milk? I mean, look. They put chicken wings on here, and I'm like, there's no way that, like, puffs of protein can taste like chicken wings. Mm. These taste like chicken wings dipped in well, the ranch. Where's the ranch? And, and buffaloes are and, all over that and stuff. And the Inferno sauce. Yes. From oh, heck. Hey. <laughs> There's a tier one. Wow. Yeah, I would have to say. I mean, flavor is a one, not taste. There's a difference. What? No. Mm -mm. Well, she oh, just shut her mouth on fire, though. Oh, my God. It hurt me. This, <laughs> I can only have the one. Luckily, you gave me two. That was so good. Like, my mouth is burning. But, I mean, the taste, oh, it's so good. Totally worth it. That's a tier one. Yes. Next, Fat Snacks, Everything Crackers. So we've had the cheddar versions mm -hmm. of these, and we've really liked them. How do you feel about everything flavor of things? I mean, what is it? Like everything flavor? flavored. Like it has poppy seeds and like garlic powder and onion flakes. So it's like a hodgepodge. Yeah, it's, it's, so it's everything. Kind of everything. That's the whole point. It's just a few things put together. Well, we'll see. Do they happen to call everything yes. flavoring? Yes. Like, have you seen like everything is... bagel? No, oh, yeah. It has like the sesame seeds and all the seeds yes. on the top. Like, that's it's... what we're talking about. Minus the bagel, it's like it's the seasoning. So it's just the name. Oh, yes. It's not like te you. this technically everything. Yeah, but it's like seven things. Yeah, it's like seven together. particular things exactly. So okay. we'll call it. Everything. My hand stuck. Do okay, I got when it. You, when you're being greedy. I got I got cracker bits. Okay, let's go. Oh yeah. Okay. I like the flavor. I just don't like the softness. I like the softness. And I like the flavor, the flavor because good. it's not really everything-y. Like, if this was super everything-y, I wouldn't like it. This is more like some of the things, right? Not everything. I mean, I like that, though. Flavor's great. I, like I just don't like the softness. I don't mind the softness. It just well, needs, I it do. needed more flavor. That's a tier one and a half for me. Yeah. Like, I really like the flavor. I'm not going to buy them because I just, like, I don't eat crackers, right? Mm -hmm. But, and if given the choice, I would definitely choose the cheddar crackers over that. Mm -hmm. but those are good standalone. No, I can't really say if you love everything stuff, you're going to love that because it tastes so much like everything. Like, I'm not even saying that, yeah. but it's a good flavored cracker. That is true. Yeah. I just yeah. don't like the texture. It could go for more salt and other flavor. Yeah, more, I mean, yeah, if it was more yes. everything, yes. I would not have enjoyed it as much as I did, so. It can be everything. You can keep the poppy. Just give mm -hmm. me more salt. Yeah. What was your uh, rating? I agree. I mean, I saw, uh, my rating flavor, uh, my flavor was one. It was good. Mm -hmm. and, uh, but three. With the texture. Okay. You, no, see, I didn't mind it. I mean, because I already, that's what I expected from that. So I already, I already knew that. Man, y'all hate all the fat snacks. Oh, crap. I mean, I like no, the I flavor. Like the salt. was delicious. Yeah. I gave it no. a one. See, but her taste buds is all burning. See, so she don't know <laughs> she what it is. She's still on fire. My mouth mm. is on fire. Oh, okay. No. Next. Oh, look at this. Catalina Crunch double feature crunch mix. Mm. I said, how is there pretzels on the front of this? And it's keto, right? But they're like, they're, what are they? Was it mm. like one pretzel per bag? Chickpea flour pretzels. But I'm like, Ooh. flour is flour is flour. Ooh. But still, but pretzels though? though? Keto pretzels though? like the so, prominent picture on there. Yeah, too. so, oh, these contain yes. pretzels. It's definitely you know? the center stage. So, 
Yeah, I mean, this is like a it's like a trail mix. Yeah, it's definitely like a two-hander. And I'll make sure you get at least one of everything. Yeah, you didn't get a pretzel. Yeah, there might be like three pretzels in this whole thing, so. Oh, I got one. Okay. I just need a pretzel and I'll have everything. You have a pretzel. The pretzel looks a little burnt, but that's okay. Okay, yeah, it's definitely a differently cooked pretzel. Yes. Okay. Like homemade pretzel. So, d it doesn't say what flavor of Catalina Crunch this is. Yeah, exactly. So maybe like a caramel so, or a peanut butter. I don't know. But it's like Catalina really Crunch tell. cereal. It is a pretzel. It is. This is a pecan. This is a cashew. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is plastic. No, girl. Okay. So let's try them. I'm going to try everything separately. All right. I'm going to do it together. I will do it separately with you. Let me try the pretzel. I'm getting more of a savory tone than a sweet tone. Are you? Oh my god. That pretzel's a pretzel. Yes. So it's it's definitely like savory. Cinnamon, like cinnamon no. And this is like a trail mix, like a like a Chex mix. Yeah, yeah them all together, but they just all taste the same. Yeah, it, it's like whatever powder coating is yeah, on the outside. Mm -hmm. Everything tastes that Everything way. just tastes like that. Like, which is not bad. I'm down with it. <laughs> yeah. It's just all the same flavor. Mm. I just if you need something in your belly real fast. Yep. Yeah, like nothing prominently stood out, but it was a myriad of textures. Now that's flavor though. And it does have a strong yeah. flavor. Yeah, that's flavor. A very Chex Mix like well, type, well. you know, type spiced thingies, you know, mm -hmm. all together. Um, this is a tier two for me. A tier two for me, dog. Mmm. I mean, let's see. What I purchase it? Because I would definitely eat it. Mm -hmm. So I that's Alicia, it. too. Right. Yeah, but it's, it. it's Alicia, yeah. too. Hey, let me see. Let me see how much it fit in my pocket. Mm -mm. No. I know it won't. Okay. Yeah, I would say 1.5. Yeah. So, and who knows how much yeah. this is. I mean, and, and if it's on this sale, could be 12 or $13. Yeah. We don't know, yeah. right? But, like, that's good. It probably good. is. But. Yeah. Okay. Definitely a tier two. That was good. But if I buy that, I'm head <laughs> And that's what I said. It's just like all of these things are very snacky. Like, don't get me wrong. That's what the keto crate delivers. It delivers mm -hmm. snacks, right? Mm -hmm. But like, everyone think about how snacks fits into your own keto and health journey. Is yeah. all we're saying, right? No, no. For me, it would be. I'm thinking this would be the great replacement instead of trying to get those airplane airport snacks. Yeah. Like any pretzels or anything from yes. them? Yes. This is a. Great I, I could definitely eat that. Like, look, I love a good like snack mix right mm -hmm. like at the airport that's probably one of my go-to's because it's so crunchy and there's a bunch of different flavors and things like that that's a great save it for this week. yeah this is you're right we should or save this oh i don't think i'm gonna save it though so <laughs> um, but you, you know maybe we house? can order them on amazon have before you, but that's what i'm saying like been in our house before? yeah like we'll i just don't know nothing. how much and this is traditional crunch mix mm -hmm. what if they have other flavored crunch I'm mixes fine with traditional. you know so but this is definitely a, a one for one replacement like i would not need any sort of other checks mix, mm -hmm. like if I had this, it wouldn't be like, oh, oh yeah. this would be oh, better yeah. if, like, oh, yeah, no. this completely replaces yeah. it. It's, it's that it. good. Yes. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. Yeah, yeah, no. So that's situationally so awesome. Yeah, situationally, tier situation. You know, like that's <laughs> depending on the situation. Yeah. Yes, no, but those are great. I can't believe those exist. Yeah. Okay, moving on. Now we are getting to the sweet stuff. You know what I'm talking right. about? So first we are trying a fat bars. Mm -hmm. We tried these before. We did a review video. Yeah. Have that? Has that come out? The fat bars? I think. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I love these fat bars. They come from England. Um, they're just so small and, you know, cute and like, oh, tee hee hee. Mm -hmm. But they're chewy. They have their own distinct oh, little yeah, sheen, like oily, you know, like they're, mm. they're unique. I'll say. Yeah, look at that. You I can. I like these. Okay. So this is raspberry almond. Ooh, it's going to be good. I and know. And fruity. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Okay, so it is very oily. It is stuck to the paper towel, so I'm hey, going to get it off. Hey, I'll be on a high fiber it. diet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm going to break it apart. And break it up is hard to okay. do. Oh, you want the big piece? Okay, all right, all right. One, two, three. Oh, very sticky. Mm -hmm. Very chewy. Very fruity. You forgot Very raspberry. Mm -hmm. I really enjoy the chew. The flavor is subtle, but you really, you definitely get the raspberry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. 
Ryan that's a tier two for me. Smacking you all the I'm not, I'm, like, if these were chocolates instead of raspberry, it might be a tier one. You know? But uh, they should good. It's a tier one for me for exactly that reason. Mm -hmm. now, these raspberries, raspberries is of kicking. Okay, I'm going to agree with Rachel. Yeah. But they are sticky and messy, so like, make sure well, you... I mean, it's the pop. Mm -hmm. They're like, ooh, so what am I eating? Mm, like ooh, I'm on a tropical pop. island or something. Ooh, it's delicious. But it was really good, so that was a tier two for me. Tier All right, one. finally, we're trying Avi Foods Avi Nola mm. granola from Avi Ancient Superfood Granola. Okay, made with lupini flakes, like mm. flakes that were made of lupini bean flour, and I'm just like, what are these ingredients, you guys? I have but no like, idea. yeah, the lupin is a type of bean, like a low carb bean or something. Yeah. That a lot of flowers are made out of. Um, well, no, that lupin flower is made out of. So it's like a low carb alternative, you know, like almond flour, coconut flour, okay. lupin flour. Here you we know. Go. Now, it, yeah, like those are definitely lupin flakes. Some flour. Yeah. So the thing that I do like is that it looks like it looks like true granola. Yeah. I'll because give you that. it has like the flaky, and you know, the, the lupin, the lupin flour. Like this isn't just an amalgamation of. Whole food. Oh, man. Who is you? Okay. <laughs> we're not worthy. We're not okay, worthy. Okay. Boss move. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, but, you know, this does look like traditional oat. Like, these could be oats. You know, oh this could be God. oatmeal, right? So it's I like, okay. I love your hypothesis. I hear it. Don't what? try it. What are you doing? I'm saying it. Okay. Let's try. It's unanimous. Okay. Hmm, I gotta say, I am a fan of lupin mm. flakes. Lupine flakes. Lupine. Mm. Yeah, I mean. I mean, if you put that in a little bowl of some almond milk, milk. Mm -hmm. and you got you a cereal. That's granola. There's like a little twinge of flavor. I don't know if that's the lupin flour, but. Twinge of flavor? Something is like hit me in a place where I don't really like. So it's a tier two for me. I mean, thank you. But even there, it just only is a tier two, you know? But the texture, the overall feel, the, I wonder if I'm eating granola right now. Like the answer is yes. You don't have to wonder, you know, like mm, that is state, like traditional mimicking granola. Yes. But there's like just a little bit of something that I'm just like, mm, what is that? But I, I mean. Like that little something. No, mm -mm. But I, I mean. I found yeah. it was unique to the party. Yeah. yeah. And every party Tier two for me. It's a two for me, dog. It's a two for me, two dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hmm. I'll say 1.5. Oh, there you go. Well, he's been, really he's like been giving it. all these 1.5s lately. Well, I mean, do I want to go to the Whole Foods and buy it today? Yeah. No, no, but, but would I? If, I if under it's on sale or something? Yeah. If it's yeah. a, a coupon day? Oh, mm, my gosh. Um. Yeah, so 1.5. I really enjoyed that. Do you, do you know who I want to know if they've ever tried lupini flour before? Me? No, no, I already know no, that you had crazy. not up until this point. But I wonder if this person has. Hey, you. The you winner. just won the Keto Crate this month. Congratulations. Send me an email to watchautumnketo at gmail.com and I will make sure that the awesome folks at Keto Crate send this one out to you. You gotta let me know how you like the lupini no, flower. So. And if you do that, we can be Keto Bestie. Oh, look, he got that at, he got that at KetoCon. <laughs> I He's love, been wearing it I ever love. since. The Keto Crate people are amazing. I talked about that on the previous video, like how we met them at KetoCon and yeah. how they're absolutely Did amazing. Did you show so. them my band? No, because you were the bestie. Thank you, honey. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Um, okay, so overall, I feel like the savory things were the star of this Keto Crate. <laughs> I mean, Namely, hello. the Buffalo oh Ranch. God. This little oh crunchy mix right yeah. here. Although I cannot say, you know, like discount enough. Like this, the fruity, this was really good. And this was amazing. Yeah, you I know. Mean, there's nothing left. Oh my god. Yeah, well, because the fat bar is yay big. Mm -hmm. I mean, don't, don't besmirch. No, it's I mean for three Look people, for up. three grown this adults. Besmirch. Besmirch. <laughs> the fat bars aren't lasting. Y'all are dumb. Okay. Uh, okay. Have a great day, everyone, and we'll catch you next month on Smash yes, the of Crate. Course. Bye. Bye. Well, you have to, it has to cut <laughs> off, man. You have to give it long enough for it to cut off. She got eyes on treats.
Okay, okay mom, yeah. you're not in the shot. Oh. Like, you're just not in the frame. Okay, um, mm, let's get some cocktails going. Talk to you, see? She's already drunk. Listen. Yeah. 